Welcome to the news in two minutes. We begin with news that electricity distribution companies, DISCOs, have pleaded for understanding from their customers as the country plunged into another blackout due to grid collapse, the second time this year. It had earlier collapsed on February 4th, which threw the nation into darkness. The River State Caretaker Committee Chairman of the All Progressives Congress APC, Tony Okocha, has told loyalists of former Vice President Atiku Abubakar, who have declared support for President Bola Tinubu, that they can join the party through the back door. Members of the defunct PDP Presidential Campaign Council in the 2023 polls, led by the former Director General, Dr. Abiyah Sakibo, on Thursday, declared their support for President Tinubu-led administration. The Central Bank of Nigeria has said that it recorded an inflow of over $1.5 billion into the economy over the past few days, indicating that its monetary policy efforts are working positively. Recently, the CBN held its 294th Monetary Policy Committee meeting, where it decided to increase the interest rate by 200 points to 24.75% from the previous 22.75%. On the entertainment scene, Amawumi, widow of the late Nigerian singer Ileriolua Aloba, known as Mobad, has cried out over what she described as constant threats to her and Liam, the baby she had with the late singer. This was as she urged the musician's father, Joseph Aloba, to get a court order for the DNA test of her son, Liam. However, in a series of Instagram posts, Mobad's widow said, she had been facing what Mobad faced before his death. Finally, in sports, Manchester City have been dealt a double injury blow as Kyle Walker and John Stones will miss Sunday's crucial clash in the Premier League title race against Arsenal. Both players were injured on international duty with England. Defending champion City are third in the Premier League, but just one point behind leaders Arsenal, who are ahead of Liverpool only on goal difference. And that's it on today's news in two minutes. Join us again tomorrow for all of our important news updates. I am Favour Aham. Um.